welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Chris Chris Han. My Instagram is Chris Han XOXO. Welcome to another video in my kitchen. Today, as you can see, I have this coffee machine right behind me. I'm gonna show you how I use this machine from Casa Bruce to make coffee at home. Ever since I tried this Casa Bruce coffee machine, I've been really enjoying my coffee from espresso to cappuccino to latte. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how I use this machine to make all the coffee. Without further ado, let's get started. Let's take a look at this machine. This is Casa Bruce 3700 Gen 20 bar espresso coffee machine. This model is a professional stainless steel espresso machine with full features, including pressure pump, single and double cup brewing, steam milk froster, and hot water. It's comparable to a lot of luxury machines, but it's a lot cheaper. To make coffee, just fill the water tank first. The water tank is 47 ounces. It's pretty sizable. Turn the rotary switch on to make hot water or warm the cup. The machine comes with a stainless steel portafilter and two cup filters, one for single shot and one for double shot. Insert the cup filter into the portafilter before use. And then fill the cup filter with your coffee. I usually fill my coffee all the way to the max line for the best flavor. The machine comes with a menu temper like this. I can easily make an even layer of the coffee in the cup filter. Make sure the cup filter is not overfilled. Insert the portal filter into the machine and turn the handle from side to front. You can see the handle points at the lock. I'm making a double espresso, so just press the double button. Now the machine is all set. You don't need to do anything, just wait for a little bit for the machine to brew your coffee. The machine has a 20 bar Italian pressure pump. It works like really quickly and really smoothly. With this Italian pressure pump, you can actually make precise extraction for aromatic coffee body really quickly. You can check the pressure at the pressure gouge. It's very easy to control and you can adjust it for the best pressure. Now my espresso is ready. It smells really amazing. It smells aromatic and very rich. My whole kitchen is filled with this beautiful smell. Now let's make another coffee, let's make a latte. And the first step is very easy, it's the same, just fill the portal filter with your coffee, all the way to the max line. And again, use a temper to make it even in the cup filter. When you install the portal filter, just make sure there is no spell of coffee outside of it. For the coffee latte, I would usually make the milk frother first. I like to use a small pitcher like this to make my milk frother. You can easily press this button on the right side. This is steaming and the frothing function and start making your milk frother. And the texturized milk is always the best. I love the velvety and the smooth texture of the milk frother that I make with this machine and it goes really quickly. You just need to manually adjust the depth of this wand in the pitcher and also the speed. In less than 30 seconds, the milk is fully texturized to look at the beautiful foam. Make sure you clean this wand by using the hot water steaming function. I like to wipe out the milk residue on the wand after every use. And then just place the mug on the tray like this and press the double shot button. When the button is blinking, it starts making coffee automatically. I'm actually new to this. I never tried any espresso machine before, but this machine is actually very easy to use. It's very beginner friendly. I really like the compact and the sleek design. It's been really elevating my coffee experience at home. I enjoy the taste, the texture and the aroma of the coffee made by this machine. You can find the Casa Bruce machine on Amazon. I also have the product link in my description down here. The retail price is only $159.99. If you're a coffee lover, you'll actually get so much out of this investment. 
The coffee is always so smooth and rich, and I like the layers, like the texture. For this latte, just add the texturized milk into your coffee, and then it's done. The milk frother is just like microfoam. It's so silky and smooth. Okay, so this is how I make my coffee with this Casa Brews coffee machine. And my family and I are extremely happy with this machine. We've been using this machine actually a lot. You can go creative with your coffee recipes, adding different flavors, different ratios of milk and coffee. I hope this video can be of some help for your coffee experience at home. Again, the coffee machine is linked in my description. You can also find it on Amazon. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.